and your uh, stamina. So yeah, they, I think this really good. Now we just gonna go This was a stronger enemy that just tried to kill me, and now my inventory is getting pretty full, so I'm gonna go back to town and sell everything I have. So, as you can see, fulminating potions are really good, are worth a lot. Worth a lot. What a bitch! Oh, there's more than uh, I had, but that's kind of strange. I don't really like using daggers, so I'm gonna sell it. What they're used for is whenever you find a lock chest, lock chests have chances to have more, to have better items than normal chests. So it's always good to have uh, some keys on you, but not always. You don't always have better stuff, but most of the time they do. Okay, what I just did is I bought um, a book of tongue portal and the book of tome of Ident identify so you have can have tw up to 20 tomes of town portal and up to 20 scroll of identity uh, it's shift right click and it fills it automatically if you want to quick buy everything all you need to do is shift right click on the item you want to buy and it's gonna buy max of it so you don't need to like right click or left left click yes oh no it's a faster way to like get buy stuff which i think was really smart from them no maybe i should go repair my armor which i don't have enough money to do probably don't have Hi enough there. money good to see you or maybe I do. Oh, I do. Now I only have five gold left. <laughs> At the beginning, you're gonna run out of gold pretty fast. So yeah, don't worry. It's normal. Because there's a bunch of stuff you need to buy and blah 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 blah. <laughs> This one, ah, oh, come on. Fuck. I just want to get a game or something so I can put it in my club. So as you can, as you saw earlier, I forgot to explain what it was. Was um, Tollstone Portal, as you can see, make you able to go back to town and faster. And the identify scrolls make you able to. Um, the order welcomes you. To just. Um, identify unidentified item which most of the time are better than identified items Whew, that was hard to say oh and as you can see I sold I just sold that stick which in the shop is worth a lot but since I'm not a sorcerer eh, I don't need it so I sold it as you can see I sold it for like 626 when in the shop, they said for um, 9,920 something. 
which this is something I find stupid because you're like usually in games you sell something and then you can buy it back for half but no for double the the thing you sold too many it, empty graves and this is the burial ground which is where Blood Raven is so we're gonna go kill her if I don't die of course trying to kill her so here's what I always do I put a town portal here so if ever I die I can come back here really fast so I don't have to die trying to back, come back here since when you die you lose all your My army will destroy. As you can see, she is pretty easy, but she moves so much. It's hard to just come over to her and just I need spam melee attacks. So if you're a melee enough mana guy, it ain't too e it ain't really easy to like just go attack you. But as you can see, if you lose my strategy and use all your As you can see, I don't have enough strength for any of these ones, which I think is kind of stupid. So I'm gonna Blood when Raven. I'm gonna level up, I'm probably gonna be Rest level well. five. Yep. So I'm gonna be able to have shield. Uh, if I put four, three, I'm gonna be able to put on the shield and uh, the armor and the bow, I might even be able to use it, but no, I don't really care about the bow, the bow. So let's go back to town. Finish. Greetings. Okay, here's what happens when you finish. I can hardly believe that you've defeated Bloodraven. Though she was once my closest friend, I pray that her tortured spirit remains banished forever. You have earned my respect, stranger and the allegiance of the rogues. I have placed several of my best warriors at your disposal. So yeah, when you uh, finish this quest, you have... Um, uh, a slave, a mercenary that helps you. And if you press O, you can't... That's only an, um, an expansion you can give her... Um, And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give her the bow I just found. I can't use that. What you? Ah, oh, she's not high leveled enough. I was like, I'm gonna give you the bow, but required level three. <laughs> it's like, yeah, ah, oh, fuck. As you can see, it ain't that strong, but just alone. But it has a lot of dexterity and strength. So right now I'm gonna use the. Um, Waypoint. Go back to Cold Plains. And I'll meet, I guess I'll meet you there, but here's what I'm gonna do. I'm probably gonna cut from me going to some places because sometimes when you already killed everything, it's like just long because to. Hey, I'm going over there. Blah, 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 blah. And sometimes I run out of things to say. Oh, those are rocks, it's just, um... Well... Well, well... Blah blah blah, Mr. Free. Okay, skill shrine. Increases the level of your skill. Earlier it was only level 4 or something like that, level 3. Now it's level 6. So yeah, this is another really good um, shrine. So I yeah, there's a lot of really good shrines I must say. And I forgot to take take my mission, but I know what it is. It is um yeah, the card game. So I'm gonna try to find a waypoint. 
Here's what you need to do for your... Uh I am overburdened. As you can see, at this part of the game, you're always going to be overburdened. I'm overburdened. I'm overburdened. So here's what you do. You drive to town. You go talk to Akara. I forgot she had to give me a quest. It is clear. That we are facing an evil difficult to comprehend, let alone combat. There is only one Haradrim sage, schooled in the most arcane history and lore, who could advise us. His name is Deckard Cain. You must go to Tristram and find him, my friend. I pray that he still lives. Okay, Tristram it is a quest that some people Hello. just do over and over again to get a bunch of experience. As you can see, I sold my armor that I had on me, but I got a much better armor, so I, I kind of feel bad for using my scroll for nothing now. But I can't wait for my mercenary to level up, because I really need her to level up. Sometimes you're going to go back from town to um, Just gonna let her rejuvenation potion. This is a really good item. I thought I had more, but whatever. Again. Okay, she's getting low on the health, so I'm gonna heal her. Thank you. <gasps> a charm. Charms are really good item depending on what on uh, what abilities they give you. Some charms are really good, some charms really sucks. This one is pretty decent, it gives you more damage, more maximum damage. I prefer the one that gives you more maximum and minimum damage. So yeah, you know, not So I'm gonna buy some more. So now I'm full on scrolls of identity. So it's pretty good. So we can keep on going. So, oh, here. Right. And so it came to pass that the Countess, who once bathed in the rejuvenating blood of a hundred virgins, was buried alive. And her castle, in which so many cruel deeds took place, fell rapidly into ruin. Rising over the buried dungeons in that godforsaken wilderness, a solitary tower, like some monument to evil, is all that remains. The Countess's fortune was believed to be divided among the clergy, although some say that more remains unfound, still buried alongside the rotting skulls that bear mute witness to the inhumanity 
of a human creature. Okay, so yeah, this is a quest that um, I just got. Which, if I find the uh, the Forgotten Tower, isn't a uh, you don't have to do it, but it's really recommended because they give you runes, money, and runes. Sometimes weapon, but I never got many good weapons from doing that quest. So yeah. I wonder if she gets experience when I kill an enemy. Oh yeah, she does. But I guess she gets more when she kills them as well. What I find also about her is that she has infinite or arrows. Those are full crow grids, they're like pretty much shamans. They just keep on spawning crows. Which is Oh, you heard that. Duke, that means that my shield just blocked the attack. Ooh, fulminating potion, I'm gonna be able to sell that. Wait, did it drop? No. <gasps> Diamond. <laughs> The order welcomes you. Why did I sell them? Okay, never mind. I should buy a few um I should sell a few of these to have a bit more space. Now I'm starting to run out of space. I don't really want to give that. The waypoint in the stony field is really hard to find. And also, there's kind of, kind of. Yes, at last. Put that to good use. See how much our damage went Put up. That to good use. Put that to good use. Uh, good old zone, but you can't hit shit. Sorry for the interruption. So this is um, a sprint shrine, as I call them. They enable you to infinite spri sprint. 